Okay guys, so I'm back with another video and I actually just came back from work so please excuse the hair and everything. But I got my Ipsy bag and this is actually my very first Ipsy bag. So I'm going to go ahead and unbox it for you guys. I'm sorry about the lighting too. It's about to storm. So I'm trying to like hurry up and film this, but I'm so excited and I really just want to use this already. So I'm going to go ahead and just get right into it. I'm so excited. You have no idea. So it comes with this little card. It says your summer story starts here and it has like a little pineapple on it. On the back, there's just some information back here. So so for the actual bag itself, it is so cute, guys. Look at it. It's like clear and has like these little ice cream cones on it, little ice cream bars. Oh my god, guys, it's so cute. I can definitely see myself using this in the summer, especially when I go on vacation. This is just something easy. You can just put your makeup in and honestly, this is really cute. I, I really like this, actually. So I'm definitely going to be getting a lot of use out of this. So let's open it up. I'm sorry if I seem a little too excited in this video. I just... I can't. I honestly, like, I've heard about Ipsy bags and BoxyCharm and all that, but I never really wanted to put the money into it. But, I mean, I'm so into makeup that I just knew I had to go ahead and subscribe for this. So, this is my first one. Oh, my gosh. I already see a couple things that I already like. So, one of the first things I'm super, super excited for is this Luxie brush. I don't own any brushes from Luxie, and I honestly think they are the cutest things ever. Like, look at this handle. Can we, can we just, look at this handle. It is so pretty. It's like this lavender color with this rose gold barrel. Um, this is their Luxie 660 Precise Foundation Brush. I actually use, like, sponges most of the time, so I've never actually used a brush for my foundation. But these bristles are super soft, and I am excited to be using this. In fact, I might even use this in a tutorial. I don't know. We must see. But yeah, this is really pretty. I'm so glad. This is one of the things that I am super excited to start trying. It's so pretty. Sorry, I know I've said that a million times, but look at it. Just look at it. So I'm going to go ahead and put this away and keep digging into here. <clears throat> so the next thing I see, it's like... As you can tell, I haven't actually like looked at this at all. It's still in bubble wrap. Ugh. Is this unprofessional? I'm not sure if this is unprofessional, but so the first thing, uh, jelly pong pong cos cosmetics. Oh no, it's in. It, I don't know if you can see it or not. But there's another wrapper. Okay, give me a minute. I need to grab scissors. Okay, so I didn't even grab scissors. I grabbed tweezers. <laughs> uh, oh. Well, that worked. Well, we got it open. So this is supposed to be their supercharged, super intense eyeshadow duo. Guys, these colors are so pretty. It's like, like a bronze color and almost like a rose gold color. I don't know if you can see that. I'm sorry again, like the lighting is so bad, but I was so excited and I had to do these. Let's see if I can swatch them. Ooh, so Okay, let's, oh, sorry, I'm going to be flipping you off. So it's like a gold. It is super pigmented, it's just hard to see. And a bronze. Super, super pretty, guys. Now my hands are all dirty. I'm just going to use the tissue paper. But look how cute this is. It's a little duo, and it comes with a mirror, too. Sorry, I'm not trying to flash you guys, but this is honestly super cute. These are actually, these are really pigmented, so I'm excited to be using these. I've never heard of this brand, actually. That's why I wanted to do this whole Ipsy bag thing, because I know there's a lot of, like, makeup brands I haven't tried yet, and that I would love to try out and just, like, explore a little bit. So, yeah, this packaging's really cute. It has, like, a little flamingo on it little hibiscus flower it's really cute so yeah so there's my second item okay so for the third thing I have this beauty pinups fearless hair rescue mask let's see oh it has <laughs> it has little foil stuff over it Ooh. now this is really good if you have it smells good if you have like damaged hair and my hair let's say 
I'm part Asian, so my hair is very coarse as is. It's not necessarily damaged, but I do have color in my hair, so that tends to, like, fry it a little bit. Like, I don't have, like, horrible hair, but it's also not, like, the healthiest thing ever. So it says, an intense corrective hair mask that helps rescue hair from thermal, mechanical, and chemical damage. Free of sulfates, parabens, and... Uh, I don't know how to pronounce the other one, so we're going to skip that word. <laughs> But yeah, so it looks like this is just a hair mask that you apply to freshly shampooed, towel-dried hair. And then you wait for five minutes and you rinse it out. So I recently just colored my hair. Um, I didn't really, like, color it color. I was trying to go for this whole, like, ombre look thing, but yeah, my hair is so dark. It takes, it's, like, so hard to go blonde, so I just, you know, I gotta go a couple times for it to be blonde, or at least how I want it. So this was gonna be nice for whenever I'm going to go like bleach my hair and all of that. I feel like this lighting is really dark and I look crazy because I just came back from work but it's fine. It's fine we're just gonna keep rolling with it because I really want to play with this stuff. Okay so the next thing I have is this caked makeup. Um I don't know what this is. It looks like a it looks like a lips a lip fondant. Hmm interesting. Let's see there's no there's no shade color on the actual package itself. So this is really cute. It's like a little cupcake. It's really cute, actually. Um, I love liquid lipsticks. I'm not sure. Ooh. Oh. Well, the cap... The packaging is really cute, but it wasn't, like, sealed shut whenever I just opened it. <laughs> the name is really cute though. It's called Low Key. I know you can't see that, but it says Low Key on it. And I think those are really cute actually. But yeah, it looks like a really pretty mauve color, almost like what I'm wearing right now. Oh, that is pigmented. Oh my gosh. I've never heard of this brand either. I love, look at that. I love liquid lipsticks too, so this is going to be perfect. And these colors, like, Obviously, I like these mauve pinky colors. I am so excited to try this. Never heard of it. Caked Beauty. Hmm. Wait, does it smell like cupcakes? Oh, guys. It smells like cupcakes. I mean, you would think it would smell like cupcakes, right? But it really does smell like cupcakes. I'm probably dumb to be, like, so excited over that, but <laughs> it smells like cupcakes, guys. Okay, so the last thing that I have in here, in this cute little bag of mine, is this Urban Decay Afterglow 8-Hour Powder Highlight. So I got a highlight. I've never tried... I lied. I have tried one Urban Decay highlight. Actually, it's like a... It was a palette, and let me tell you, it was not good. I love Urban Decay too, but like that palette was just not... It was not good. It was like chunky glitter, and it was just... Girl, it was not good. So this is what it looks like. It looks like it's a little like champagne color. I can't get over how pigmented this liquid lipstick is. I'm gonna need, I need one of those like little containers that you can do this on. Okay, so this is definitely not, yeah, that's, that's pretty. I don't know if you guys can see that or not, but that's really, that is really pretty. It definitely adds a sheen. Yeah, I, I almost want to like put some on my nose. <gasps> uh, let me fix that. Um, yeah, that that's really pretty actually. Um, <laughs> let me just go to town, you know, just put some highlight on. But like you can already see. Um, yeah, this is, this is really pretty. I am shocked by this actually. This is a really good Ipsy bag. Like, I don't know why I'm so surprised. I guess I just didn't think. Like, I got Urban Decay. I got a liquid lipstick. I got a Luxie brush. I love brushes. I'm in a... I'm going through a phase right now where I absolutely love brushes. But, guys, this is... This is a really good Ipsy haul. I am very surprised, actually. And this highlighter is so pretty. Like, look at that. All I did was put a little bit on my nose. And that's already killer. Killer! <laughs> Alright guys, so that is actually going to be the end of this unboxing. That was all I have on here. So out of everything, like on a scale of 1 to 10, I definitely give this 
about a 9.5 to a 10. This is a really good one and this bag is so cute. I'll definitely be using this for the summer whenever I go on vacations. So yeah, sorry it's kind of like uh, bad lighting and all that stuff but I came home to this package and I was so excited and I just want to start using this stuff so and it's my very first bag so I'm excited. So until next time guys, bye.